much for keeping it Y254. This is Y in the morning. My name is Ram Maguko, and as always, we value your feedback. If at all you're joining us, uh, you're just in time for the next conversation of the day. And today, let's talk about stress amongst the youth. How can the youths deal with stress? What are the reasons as to why we have so many cases of suicide? People killing each other. Is it stress? Today, let's understand this particular issue, even as a parent. This conversation should, uh, you know, enable you to know how to deal with your with your child, with your teenager, with your youth that you stay with at home. How best can you handle stress when you're dealing with that particular person? Is it school? Is it work? Is it business? Is it relationships? Is it social life? What is the problem? Today I'm joined by Samuel Wanjiru. He is a counseling psychologist to help us in this conversation. Karibu sana Samuel. Thank you, thank you, Lam. Yeah, and yes. uh, uh, thank you for finding time to join me. Uh, what one is a part of social media in case one attack could tweet up? Yeah, they can find me at uh, Sami Wanjiro. Mm -hmm. Sami is S A W M I Wanjiro. Uh, Facebook at Samuel Wanjiro. And uh, also via Instagram at Sami Wanjiro. Wonderful, wonderful. And ensure that you also participate with us on this conversation at Ram Aguko and at Y254 channel on Twitter and on all my social media handles. The hashtag is Y in the morning. Uh, we are also broadcasting live on our website at www.kbc.co.ke forward slash Y254. Ensure that you head over there. That is www.kbc.co.ke forward slash Y254. So that you can follow us online if at all you would like to you know, uh, join this conversation on the go because at the end of the day it's all about understanding stress among the youth remember uh, this conversation we shall sample your feedback on this conversation as we continue uh, uh, talking on this particular show so Sam um, there's so many people who normally ask this question I've heard it people say it that we when in dogo sana exactly. you're still young you know uh -huh. you don't have this you don't have that Stress. Is it okay to even say that? Is it? Is it? Are they justified? Is it that young people should not be stressed? I think they are not justified. Mm -hmm. Even young people should be stressed. You see, when you talk of stress, it's a response to answer a challenging circumstance. Yeah. And not only even we say plants do get, because get stressed. Plants. Plants. Animals. Mimea. Mimea. With excess water, plants will get stressed. Ah. What about a human being? Wow. Even an uh, infant, mm. newborn, get stressed. Oh, so, saying when you do go stress, it's not just right. How is your family? How is your family? How is your family? How is your family? Yeah, there are so many circumstances that can lead to stress. Well, I, I, I was looking into this. According to the World Health Organization, you know, half of all mental health con uh, conditions start at the age of 14 years. Yeah, mental conditions, mental, mental disorders. Conditions. Mm -hmm. But stress can start as early as a young newborn, just a newborn. Is, is, is stress, can it also have, uh, is it connected <coughs> to any mental disorder in any way? There is a connection. Uh -huh. uh, those with, uh, people with mental disorders, they are more prone or susceptible to stress. Uh -huh. But uh, stress is just a response of your body. Like, uh -huh. for example, uh -huh. if right now somebody enters, a stranger enters this room uh -huh. where we are, uh -huh. all of a sudden your body will react. Lady for a fight, lady for a flight, either mm -hmm. fight or flight. Mm -hmm. That flight mechanism, mm -hmm. your body is stressed. And the less pawns, it depends. We have both negative and positive uh, stress. You uh -huh. can even be stressed. If today you are told that you are promoted, mm -hmm. you'll be stressed because of the new responsibility. But at the same time, you may be happy because of your uh, increment of salary. So, so this is what stress is by definition. But, 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 but you're saying there is positive and negative. Yes. Um, okay, clarify that. What, what kind of, uh, how, how can someone say that maybe you're going to positive stress? Positive stress. <laughs> eh? yeah. uh, I'm sitting for an exam tomorrow. Uh -huh. My mind will be prepared and I'll be forced to prepare for the exam. Mm. Because of the stress of failing the exam, I may, this might be a positive uh, starting point for me so I may okay, work okay. harder I mm. may work harder towards the exam that is positive 
Okay. Uh, another example to the young people: uh, you have a new, you have a date tomorrow mm. with your fiancé. Mm -hmm. You'll be stressed. How should I behave? How should I behave? How in, should I look? How should I look? How should I dress? That How should positive. I even? That, that <laughs> that's positive stress. That's positive stress. <laughs> and can something positive? Can positive stress turn to negative stress? Yes, it can. I order this negative stress. Negative stress is pos let's, maybe we can look at how positive stress can lead to negative, uh, negative effects. Okay. Uh, for example, if you're not if you get promoted today, mm. and you are not able to handle the new responsibilities, the effects will be more negative because you may be overwhelmed by your new responsibilities. Okay. okay. Uh, if you are not able to handle new situations which we are positive, the effect might be negative. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But when you talk of negative uh, stress, uh, these are circumstances surrounding us which are the, the situations we are not able to handle. Uh, maybe we can give an example. Mm -hmm. uh, you are unwell or in your family somebody is unwell and you are expected to take over some responsibility in that family. So in the process, that is negative stress, and that negative stress that uh, is affecting you will add up uh, having effects to you. Because uh, when you talk of stress, it's more of mental. And when we have mental issues or emotional issues, we have issues of hormones. And these hormones, uh, when they are in your body, when they are excess, they may have negative effects. So mm -hmm. uh, either positive or negative, negative. stress mm -hmm. have an effect. But, 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 but I'm looking at this. Um, worry is uh, how, how can someone say that I'm not stressed, I'm just worried about just some small worry. In the sumo to click it over, but I'm not stressed. Is, is there any any way of dis, uh, distinguishing or, uh, di, uh, or or differentiating between someone who is uh, stressed and someone who's just slightly worried about a particular issue? Yeah, worries, the symptoms are just uh, negligible when you come okay. to all this. But stress, when you have accumulated stress, mm. you have some symptoms even in your body. So being worried and being stressed are uh, different? They are, they, they, there is a very thin line. Okay. Worries may lead to stress. Accumulated uh -huh. worries may lead uh -huh. to stress. Uh -huh. Because stress becomes prolonged. When it becomes prolonged, mm. uh, that is the time that you may find yourself that now you have a dire effect. All right, all right. I, I yeah. want us to take a short break. Okay. And, but when you're back, you said something earlier. That when you're in your room, when someone enters, uh, 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 there's a way you respond to yeah. it. I want us to, when, when we come back, we look into, um, you know, the, 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 the psychological or, 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 or emotional signs that someone is stressed. How can someone know that they are stressed? Okay. Before we that. And after that break, we'll also look into schools. How can you, as a teenager, handle stress? Because at the end of the day, life is always going to be full of worries. Sure. Cindy, yeah. stress goes to kid too. How best should you handle yourself, regardless of the stress, and not make bad decisions? Let's take that short break. Short break. We'll be back in a bit. This is why in the morning. Well, this particular day, we are talking about stress among the youth. Do you have somebody who you feel is stressed? And um, I'm with uh, you know, Samuel Wanjiro, who is a, a counseling psychologist, to help us understand how to deal with stress. Uh, do you have a, a child, a son or daughter? Do you have a teenager in the house? Do you have a youth in the house? How best can you deal with them? And how can you help them deal with themselves? The hashtag is why in the morning at Ram Maguko and at Y254 channel. This is the conversation that we are talking about today, understanding stress among the youth. Let's talk about this. Wanjiro, uh, yes. when someone is stressed, um, there's a way they behave. There's a way they, uh, uh, you know, a change. Mm -hmm. for, for us, how, you know, how best can someone do that self-assessment? You know, is it possible for you to, to, to analyze yourself and say that uh, based on these signs, I am stressed. Is it possible for an outsider to observe you and say this person is stressed? So technically, what are these signs or, or, or and symptoms if if they are there of a uh, uh, stress? Uh, basically, <coughs> you said that st uh, stress 
whether there is a change of behavior mm. and uh, there is that behavior change and because this issue is emo both emotional it's mental it's psychological uh, you can easily note yourself self-assessment self and at the same time mm. uh, people allowed you may easily note for example, you may isolate yourself from the others. Mm. Uh, you are used to hanging out with friends, and because you are stressed up because of financial issues, family issues, work-related issues, you isolate yourself from the rest of your people. Mm -hmm. they, you are no longer even in the social media. But at the same time, somebody who was not too much in the social media, somebody may all of a sudden from lawyer, boom, you find the person in the social media. I'm back. I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, somebody, you see that posting 10 photos, uh, somebody posting uh, even 10 years old photos, mm. uh, trying to amuse, amaze people and showing people that I'm back. Those are, those, are, those are small things that show someone you is can, Yes, even the post, the kind of post you are, you are, you are posting. It, wow. You can wow. easily analyze and see this person has an issue. So for, for people who um, are not always online and all of a sudden they are frequently making posts, it's a sign that they are trying to deal with something. Yes. But you know they are not actually handling the, uh, the, the stress. <coughs> they are not getting a solution through that. You see it's a behavior change. You've changed. You are trying to adapt to the new uh, kind of lifestyle or mm -hmm. kind of uh, issues that are pushing you. Okay. And that because now you, can, you are not able to address directly the issue, mm -hmm. you direct these uh, issues to another line, which is maybe the social media. Just mm -hmm. that, just want to mention. Because you're trying to put your direct your energy towards something. Exactly. Okay. Uh -huh. Social gathering. You mm -hmm. avoid. You used to attend social gatherings. You, you used to go to places like churches, places of worship. You no longer go because you are stressed. You, want, you are trying to avoid people. And this is why we all need to look for, out for each other. And they stop doing it. Find out why. Check out, check on him or her. You call. Yes, find out. Do and uh, psychological changes. Th those are behavioral. Those are behavioral. Psy psychological. Psychological. This person may from nowhere anger. This person mm -hmm. changes. You find the person is aggressive. The person was not aggressive before, but from nowhere, this person becomes very aggressive. And akasirika alaka. This person before in a place of work or even at home, mm. this person could just come into the house, there is a lot of joy in the house, then from nowhere this person is trying to avoid all the good things this person was doing. What about someone who always ends up getting in constant trouble? They, they, they used to be okay, but nowadays you know, things have changed and uh, you know, they find themselves always getting into you know, problems and mistakes and sagas and you know, issues left, right, center. You find them always on their police OB. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you find them there every now and then. Uh, because maybe this person has, because of the stress, uh, you're not able to handle your issues. Uh -huh. And because you're not able to handle your issues, every, every time you're annoyed, the way you react, you can even assess yourself and say, is that the same way I used to react sometimes back? What has changed in my life? Something changed. Something has changed. Mm -hmm. uh, issue of uh, some even body pain, back ache. Back ache is also a sign of stress. Yeah, it can be a sign of stress. Stomach oh. ache. <laughs> yeah, heart racing, increased heartbeats. Uh -huh. Because now of the increased hormones in the body increases the level, the rate of heartbeat in the in your in your heart. So these are also some of the uh, biological issues that you may changes you may see in your body. What, what, what about someone who always uh, you know they they, they they now tend to be emotional you know things now begin to affect them in ways that they never used to before and Analia sana Analia. You know? yeah uh, emotional changes emotional changes all mm. these are signs of stress wow. 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 and uh, you see, unfortunately we are in Kenya or we are human beings huh? <laughs> and uh, those people who come to Nairobi can they avoid traffic jam you can never avoid traffic jam and yeah. since you cannot avoid traffic jam, mm. you cannot be able to avoid the stress. All what right. is important is how you deal with the traffic jam in Nairobi. Right. Do, you have, do you know the rules to escape traffic? The same case. Do you so know how the rules to escape stress? Is stress is traffic. Yes. But like any kid, when you find any when you rack, on attack, you pick up all that's the day the traffic is there. But you have to come to come up with a route that will take to you to where you wanted to go. Okay. Um. Let's go quickly. When we are talking about uh uh uh, uh you know school. 
um, uh, and, 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 and work and business and social life. How can a youth deal with stress? How can the youth deal with the stress? Hobbies are very important, especially mm. for the young people. Mm. Develop hobbies. And if you're, you're a teenager in school, there are books to read. There are quite a number of books to read. Uh, you interact with friends, speak about what is disturbing you. Yeah. Open up if they, you are feeling of uh, people speaking about you. Mm. In schools, we have a, a guidance and counseling department. Yeah. <laughs> Go there, talk to the teacher in charge. Talk to someone. Talk to someone. Mm -hmm. Share out what is disturbing you. Mm. Yeah. We have, we have people who normally say, "Ach a stress." Someone advises you, "Ach a stress." Uh, uh, you know, to lear, to lear, to lear. Is it? Is that also a solution? Uh, how? Ach a stress. This Ache person stress. should guide you. Uh. How do you? Uh, should show you the rule. It's like somebody telling you, uh. I stop eating." Then, how do I deal with hunger? Show me how to deal with the hunger. Uh -huh. So, the same case, if you're telling me to arch a stress, you should also guide me to show me how do I avoid this stress? How do yeah. I deal with the yeah. stress? Yeah. 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 And, uh, and for, for someone who is, uh, you know, um, go, going through school, uh, you know, that pressure of uh, succeeding and passing in examinations and trying to go to the next level in terms of their academics, how best should they work through that, kind, that, that, that season of worry? Uh, first is setting realistic goals. In life, people are setting unrealistic goals. Mm -hmm. Parents are giving their young ones a lot of pleasure. Because you yourself, you are a, a teacher, you want your daughter or a son to be a teacher. So, uh, set <laughs> realistic goals. <laughs> Work within <laughs> your limits. <laughs> exactly. Work within your limits. And we are limited. At some, all of us, we have some limitations. Somebody was to be a doctor, mm -hmm. another one was to be a teacher, another one was to be a secretary somewhere. Mm. So work within your limits. The same case when it comes to, a, to, to class. Uh, if you know you are still a learner, take time to lead. Well, stop uh, going hanging out with the people whom you know that they are mighty, they are like, uh, they photograph everything and they understand there and there. Mm -hmm. So plan yourself well. You will mm -hmm. avoid all that pleasure. Mm -hmm academic pleasure plan yourself well set your limits and work within your limits have, have a timetable in other words yeah also, yeah mm. because you know you, you know how you understand your books exactly so to avoid stress you have in your summer what time should i wake up mm -hmm. what time should i read yeah and for how long and how long yeah yeah um, now do parents also have a role in uh, influencing the rate of stress among the youth yeah, they have a they have a, a greater load. How how do how, how do they help in this particular scenario here? Uh, every person, the foundation of somebody's life is a family, mm -hmm. and we all start from the foundation. The build, for the building to start, it all depends with the foundation. Mm -hmm. The parents should uh, come up with good foundation for their young ones, if as they grow. Mm -hmm. Let them understand their young ones. Mm -hmm. Even at home, you realize that uh, a brother and a sister, or this, among the siblings, they have different ways of dealing with pleasure. You find that somebody, a, a young boy who is even five years, he, he is not able to deal with an issue. Even uh, like he's riding a bicycle, there is a, a mechanical issue, technical issue, the boy starts crying. Mm -hmm. Another boy will just pick the bicycle, Start working on it and decide and comes away of leading the bicycle. Mm -hmm. This one who has a, who started crying, mm -hmm. this person shows that he has a weakness. He is weak emotionally. Mm -hmm. He is not able to handle his issues well. So can you start helping this person at that formative stage mm -hmm. to understand mm -hmm. that if you are faced with a life challenge, how do you deal with it? You can pick yourself up again. Exactly. Not, so not, that, that, that's what a, what a parent needs to do. You be that strength to your child. Yes, understand your child. Mm -hmm. As early as this child is two, three years, you'll be able to see this how your son behaves. Mm -hmm. uh, there are some with the phobias, even insects. There is a cockroach in the house. Mm -hmm. The child is on, the, on top of the chair. Mm -hmm. Others are hiding. They are crying. Understand this person has an issue. Requires kind of tender care. And at the same time, support. Help this child to understand mm. that these 
this is as among the like the challenges you have to face if you are feeling of a cockroach mm. uh, uh, you have this child as he grows to understand how to deal with other life challenges you, you don't just snob, snob it it's not me acha acha ujinga kuwa mwanaume kuwa mwanaume kuwa mwanaume one comment that normally kills uh, you know um, uh, the, the ego of many uh, boys especially upcoming uh, you know yes kuwa uh, mwanaume kuwa mwanaume kuwa mwanaume does it mean you already ni mwanamke you are trying to change this person kuwa mwanaume anaogopa mende anaogopa mende kuwa mwanaume now you've started killing this boy to help him to understand himself and understand the inner person because we are created made yeah. different biologically genetically we are very different well, i know um what about this issue of uh, you know uh, parents telling their their kids nataka ukwe daktari ama nataka ukwe engineer i want you to be this kind of a person mm -hmm. and that kid you know it is in their heart that i must be this i must do this course mm -hmm. because that is what my parent wants okay can that also play a role in exaggerating or uh, you know laying a lot of stress on this particular youth that you you there is what you want your child to be mm -hmm. but there is what has made this person there is the inner person in this person whatever he is supposed to be mm -hmm. and there is what you want out of this person so the, you take somebody to you force him or her to become an engineer but this person was sub, to be somebody a very different person this person was to be the just journalist of the nation mm. this person there are some parents who are taking some courses because of the plight they want to attach themselves with the society mm. my son is so and so my son is an engineer my mm. son is a doctor mm. my son is a lawyer uh, and sees other uh, laws in the society as a minor minor laws mm. and at the end of the day you you pile a lot of pressure to your son or daughter so what happens in the future this the engineer will go there and he or she is working for the parent and not from the passion so parents need, need, need to understand that uh, you know give them space to be who yes. they want to be discuss with the young ones what, no, what, in the case where someone has done their kcpe that kcse yeah we had the res results that were just, yeah. uh -huh. just the other day mm. someone is stressed out there because according to the parent they wanted an a or a b but they got a c plus or a d and then you failed you've disappointed mm -hmm. me now they are stressed they're wondering what to do some have, some have even committed suicide yes because uh, the parents there is the pride of the parent mm -hmm. i all uh, there is a way this, this I have placed myself in the society and maybe even some others they had seen that as an opportunity mm. to uplift themselves mm. the success of the son or the daughter was the an opportunity for the parent to approve him or herself in the society mm. so the son or the daughter has failed now you pile now pleasure and you even some of them they are going to an extent of abusing their children kanani i wonder who is a when him toto wanani and some we have heard them like some value get kuwa mkate because uh, <laughs> of the parents expectation but at the end of the day uh, they, you pile pressure on your daughter your son he or she commits suicide then you start crying what should a parent do when when they ex they expected something from a child but that child has failed to deliver accept the reality mm -hmm. There is the ideal situation or everybody should pass but the reality is some have to pass others have to be average above average and below average and what about the youth now that i have not succeeded in what i wanted to do how can a youth deal with that kind of stress uh, somebody got a discipline this person goes for a certificate the person next after certificate diploma degree and even masters it all depends you may fail today mm. the problem is that shall we remain there on the ground mm -hmm. lies up and move on right there is the always a way up mm -hmm. to the top now there is this pressure to fit in yes we are trying to conform conforming to groups mm. i want to join such a social group peer pressure peer pressure i want mm. to join such a group mm. so uh, you go to a school you are you go to a campus you go there and find that there is a such certain social group mm. and they have set their rules our rules is that you have to be a drunkard you have to be a b and c so you force yourself into that group 
And because you want to conform to the norms of that group, mm. you end up have, having a lot of stress. Mm. Youths should realize that we have no rehearsal for this life. Live your life, not the life of others. Wow. Yeah. Powerful. In this life, there's no rehearsal. There's no rehearsal. Live your life. Not the life of others. Not the life of others. Yes. Thank you very much, uh, 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 Councillor. Yes. He, I, I was with uh, uh, Samuel uh, Wanjiro. He is a counseling psychologist. We are talking about youth. Uh, you know, a stress dealing with stress among the youth. Uh, you know, how best can you handle uh, your child? How can you handle yourself? And the one thing that I realized is during this conversation, youths have piled pressure on themselves so much so that they make bad decisions for themselves. Life is not a rehearsal. It's not a rehearsal. Live your own life. Live your own not life. The life of someone else. Yeah. Thank you so much, Samuel. I appreciate it. Welcome. That brings us to the end of this conversation. Uh, right on Y254, we are taking a short break. After this, we are back with so much more. Keep it right in the morning.